Hey everybody, welcome to Himiko. This is a new indie horror game on Steam. You can get it for 99 cents. Uh, yeah, this is the main menu. There's just nothing really on it. Uh, so the store page says, Himiko is a short, dark, atmospheric horror puzzle game with a very complicated story, but rather simple gameplay. Uh, and then it says about this game, Himiko is a short, dark, atmospheric horror puzzle game with a very complicated, but uh, rather simple gameplay. Yeah, yeah, all right. The game requires the player to understand the story in order to progress through the game. There are secret notes in the game that don't actually exist in the game's universe. They are only here, only there to help you understand the story. The story is about a doll that got possessed by the lost soul of a dead young woman, Himiko. Day after day, the doll started turning into human. However, recently, Himiko started having weird nightmares that she can't wake up from because she doesn't understand what is happening and why it's happening. Will you be able to wake up Himiko from her terrible nightmares? And there's like a bunch of stuff being like, Attention, please don't buy the game if your PC doesn't meet the minimum system requirements. The game will glitch and not work as intended. Minimum performance, yet. Yeah. So it basically needs to run at 1080p, 6 frames a second. Otherwise, it fucks up. Uh, the game is not easy. The game is has no key rebinding. The game has no graphic settings. The graphics are set on high quality. You can't change them except for the resolution. This game is based on Sigmund Freud Dream Theory. The game is slow and dark to give the feeling of being in a dream. So, with that in mind, let's go ahead and just jump in. Let's uh, check out Himiko. Can I even use my controller? What's <laughs> up, Himiko? I don't know why I'm doing this. Sleep is a four-phase process in which humans periodically rest with greater or lesser degrees of consciousness and decreased responsiveness to the surrounding world. Sleep occurs, uh... Psychically? Psychically? <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, so we play as Himiko. And also, this is as bright as I can make the game. Remember, there's no graphic settings. Like, this is... This is the game. I'm gonna try to use my controller. This is third person. Of course, there's a fucking katana. Okay, good. I can use the controller. Good. Good, good, good. Also, there's 47 Steam achievements in this game. Uh, you didn't see that one. That one's called Take Your First Steps. I uh, just got another one called Get a Weapon. And I got one when I first loaded the game called Hello. Oh boy. Here, can I... Ooh, spooky sounds. Uh, here, let me... Maybe I can turn it up in... There, I bumped up the gamma by 10% in my recording software. Gun she called Boo. Gun she called Hit. Got an achievement called Hit. Wait, no, uh, kills one. Yeah, so, oh my god, holy shit. So you're getting an achievement for fucking everything in this game. Got another achievement called Boo. Here, can I... I want to... Let me switch over to window capture really quick. One second. There we go. All right. I want you guys to see, like, all the... achievements I'm getting. Just for, like, random innocuous shit. <laughs> oh no!
What is this? Like, I wonder why they were like, hey, let's let's buy this. The door is locked, you need a golden key to open it. Let's buy this like like asset pack off the Unreal store. Throw in a little Asian girl and publish it. Look at this Hulkin motherfucker. Sup, buddy? Do I have any other attacks I can do? Nope, just one attack. Damn, you a biggin. Can I talk to you or do you No, you attack. Wow, wow. Fine. Get fucked, motherfucker. Wow. What? I come on, man. I killed it as it killed me. Come on. All right, Hemiko, let's do this again. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. This is on Steam. This costs money. Oh boy. And like this is like the in the sore page is like the most like pseudo aggressive thing I've ever read. It's like don't buy this game if you can't run at 1080p 6 frames a second. Cuz I can't change the graphics quality in 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 uh whenever I'm coding this. And it's like this game is not easy. <laughs> this game is very dark. All right, let's try this again. There we go. Yeah. Oh, I got a gym called Zauder. Oh, why is he on fire? I wonder if I was supposed to kill him on top of the switch. To make him open. Yeah, let's, let's die again. <laughs> this game's too good. Honestly, this game's just too good. I it, like. It's just too amazing, honestly. Like, uh... Yeah, so, like, I've been trying to avoid playing... Little... Like, obviously, like, terrible indie horror games. Because, like, after, like, Resident Evil 7 and... A few other games that I played this year, I'm just like, I don't want to. Like, I just don't want to. But this, uh, this is... This is pulling me back in. This is... This is amazing. Alright, buddy. Come here. Can you actually open the switch? You can. Yeah, let's... Alright, come on. There you go. I think whenever he falls backwards... Oh, what the fuck? Note? Really? That's... Yeah! Alright. Let's get on the other hallway first. I am so tired of this cutscene. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright. Oh, I wish I could I wish I could do anything. I wish I could I wish I could run. I wish I could jump. Like I just don't I just don't get it. Like I I don't know, I just don't get it. Like, do you guys feel like you're in a dream state? Do you guys feel like you're in a dream? Yeah, like, that's a, that is a stock asset. Which, that's fine, like, you know, if, if developers want to, you know, use stock assets, they get off, like, the Unreal Store, that's fine. Like, I'm not gonna judge them. It just like use them differently. Like you do like I don't know, just do something different with them. Don't just be like spooky chair placed here for no reason. I'm getting so many fucking achievements. When you're asleep, your subconscious mind gradually takes over your conscious mind. Alright, so I think I do need to somehow 
get that big giant guy to open the puzzle switch door thingy for me. Miko, baby girl, you need to start. You need to start booking. All right, you need to. You need to hurry up. You need to go. Can I, can I open this door? Is even a door? Uh, the door is locked. No keyhole. Okay. All right, let's try this door over here again. This guy's gonna kill me though, cause. He has so much health, and he hits so hard. I see another note back there. Here, let's try to... Hey, buddy. Yeah, and like, we walk at the same pace, so I can't just like... I can't escape him, really. Oh, he's too big to... So why does he get all fucking hot? I just, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. I don't get it. Like what? Great fucking note. Fucking awesome. Remember the guys, there are hidden notes scattered throughout the game world that aren't actually there. They'll help you understand the story. And I can't move. I can't. I can't move. What is this garbage? Alright. That fucking asshole. Alright. So it really seems like I have to kill him on the switch. Maybe I just did it wrong. Maybe. Maybe the body doesn't have any weight, it's on the feet. Maybe I just need to kill him while he's standing on the switch. Because I thought if he fell back onto it, that would weigh it down. But, you know, there you just can't... You can't overthink Miko. He's got to take it for face value, I suppose. Miko. Miko. Let's buy this little Japanese girl <laughs> asset and put her in this spooky area asset. All right, good. So that held it down. Got an achievement called At Last. For whatever reason. Okay, walking around in completely dark. That is that is blinding. Holy shit, stop. Oh my god. What was the point of making him on fire? Just to be annoying? Like, is that, is that the point? I don't even know if I can walk by him. There we go. Okay, good. Yeah, so what was the point of making him on fire? What's the point? <laughs> Just being a dick. Alright. Is it through this door? There we go. Achievement called Good Memory. Why? I remembered how to hit. Hi, Hemiko. But you're oh, but she was blonde. Subconscious mind is three thousand times more powerful than your conscious mind. She even called Boo. And another hit. Another she even called Awesome Kill. What the fuck? Another one called Hit. I can't move from this screen. Okay, there we go. Oof. I, I was like, oh my god, this crashed again. Yep, silver key. Fuck off.
All right, was it this door? This one might have been gold. There we go. I wish there was some way to regen health. Because I am going to be fucked here in a second. A golden key. Where was the silver key door? Was it... Oh, it was, it was past this guy. Fuck, that is, that is hard to look at. That is blinding. All right, let's not touch him. Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. There we go. Here's the gold key. Fuck off. Thank you. Uh, got the gold key. Item equals yes, spooks equal go. Please go get off my face. An achievement called Boo. I'm getting so many Steam achievements. Oh, there's another hit. Kill eight. Cool. Got another achievement called Hit. Awesome. Go. There's the gold key. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Why am I doing this? Out of all the games I could have played today. Why did I pick this one? Uh, What you see is not always what it seems. And you can call Unlocker. Is there like an invisible wall? Here, can I... Let's go back. What? What? Do I, hold on, do I have to kill everything in the, in the map first? Here, let's drag you out. Let's kill everything first. Hopefully I don't die. I always get nervous because like they always go for that one last swing. All right, now you're coming at me. Come on, Miko, baby. Only got one more. I don't really want to fight him in the darkness because I can't see shit. Oh fuck! All right, so there's one more enemy, I think. Unless there's one more hiding in the darkness somewhere. All right, come with me. What if I need the notes? Do I need the notes? <laughs> Fuck you! No! <laughs> okay, so if you kill... Uh, certain monsters in the doorway. You can't... Can't walk past them. So... Also, a uh, giant guy died standing up this time. Himiko! Himiko, baby. Why are you doing this to me? Himiko! Ah. I'm gonna beat this game. I'm gonna beat it.
Okay, so I killed all the enemies. Uh, still that invisible wall. I collected all the notes, except for this last one that freezes you right here. Still an invisible wall. And this last note still freezes you. It's like I'm good. Uh, this is... Awful. This should not be on Steam. This should not cost money. This is barely a game. This is some asset uh, packs and maps thrown together in the most haphazard way ever and shit out on a Steam. This shouldn't... This isn't anything. This isn't done. This isn't... This isn't anything. I just, I just don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> How does this happen? Like... Like, I know, I know developers that had a really hard time getting through Steam Greenlight. Uh, like the guy who made Deceit. Uh, he has a sequel coming out, and he was having a hard time with his Greenlight campaign. Uh, Spooky's Jumpscare Mansion. That had a hard time getting through the, the Greenlight campaign. How does something like this get through? And I, I just don't understand. I just don't, under I just don't get it. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed. Ooh boy!